Oh, and behold, Thresh is the one that's Thresh is excited, Brady. It, it Trust is. Me. It is. Well, I would have preferred Namura. It's much more excited. Fnatic come in. But Genji gets completely stunned up. He's going to get locked up. The Ignite is burning on him. All five members come in there. It's so as that gets first blood. It's Genji goes down. And now Darian's being chased out up towards the top. Looks like Edward is going to make his escape. He's going to go for the teleport away. Will he get away in time? Yes, he will. In the mid lane, it looks like Diamond's setting up. And they may go in for Picky. That's a flash. A flash goes in. Galax is just going to lock on towards him. Diamond should come in to finish it off. Guns managed to lock him down and that is another kill this time for Gambit. They're going straight in towards him. He has to force the flash straight away. It's going to be a tower die, but it's not enough. Coming around the backside, he's going to be Diamond, though. Can he lock on towards him? Darian! Flash comes out from Soas, gets locked on towards him, but Diamond could go for the double kill. Get Soas, get one down. Cyanide is down, doesn't fancy taking on Soas. This time he's keeping on. Yellow's gone in! Gone flash straight in. Timber's on towards him, but there's not enough damage coming out. And now Yellow Star gets pulled in towards the tower. Diamond joins them at the top here. This could turn out horribly for Fnatic. But it's going to be a double kill! The Super Mega Death Rocket! Oh! Flashed away by Reckless, but can he close the gap? He's going to go in towards Reckless. He should. No. Barrier bait pulls him out, and they don't get anything. Ladies, it happened. The start. Now they're on Darien. That's a quick assault battery out towards Darien. They try and knock him back. They're going to have to go full dive on this one, and they may well be able to do it. He forces them back. Tower hits going on towards Soas. Pops the ulti. What is he doing? He's got Alex each coming in as support. Go tries to lock in. Cyanide's going to be the focus target. There's the stat stealing going on. Cyanide taken low, but is it going to be too much? Can they turn it around? The teleport comes in there. They try and get around this one, and Soas forces them back. Combo. Flash Timbers on towards Genja straight away. He should be at Dot away. No. Completely locked up. And he had nothing he could do. No. Remember, Shockwave was already used. The cooldown's down. They do take the tower down. Diamond has to try and jump away from this one. Dragon's Descent is going to help him get away. One kill goes towards Gambit, but is it going to be enough? They're going to try and tank off. Look at Soas going in there. He wants Edward. He gets Edward. Can he finish off anyone else? It doesn't seem that way. It's going to be a one for one jungler for support. So grouping up Diamond. He's going to go in. Sadem's come down. He has the fight. Yeah. It's Darien they're going to focus on towards, but the Shockwave doesn't manage to really land. It's only Darien. Darien tanking out all the damage. There's the Cullen coming out now. Dow can this time. Alexis, he needs to land the target in the right position, but it's not going to happen. It's Diamond he went for. Alexis not going to land his combo, and now he's in trouble. That's going to be his Mimic going down, and now Genja's trying to run away from this one. Fnatic doing a fantastic job of chasing. The pillar stops him dead. Darien is in all sorts of trouble. There's going to be a duel between Genja. Can he turn it around? No. Pekka gets in there. It's a double kill for Reckless. Edward's in trouble now. He's going to get chased down. It could be the triple. Yes, it will. Reckless is 6 0 2. This is a fantastic position for Fnatic. They engaged the dragon knowing that Genja wasn't there. Gambit blew so many resources to try and kill Cyanide, and Cyanide got away. He didn't even expend his flash. The rest of the carries from Fnatic were just able to uh, pick targets single, one at a time, because Diamond Prox and, and Darian. They went in alone. They had, they didn't have the support of the rest of the team. It was a split-up gambit. Fnatic win the fight, get a bunch of kills, and Baron, and now they're in a commanding lead. It works so, so well. Now they're going to engage. He's dead. That's going to be another kill. Peke picks it up this time around. There's a shockwave pulling in the rest of Gambit. Gambit are dropping like flies. It's a triple kill for Peke. Can he get the quadra? Diamond is just going to bully them away. They don't care. They're going for the tower. Soas didn't even use his ultimate in that fight. The Dive potential of that via Assault and Battery shut down Gambit. Now they're onto the inhibitor turret. That's going to be the inhibitor going down. Diamond can't prevent this one. He has to back away. The rest of Gambit coming out now as they're going to slowly spawn Diamond joining them. But that is the first inhibitor of the game. They're going to go toe to toe. Very slow, boring fight. Well, he's got his sadism available. There is the ultimate being popped. Tries to just jump around there. He may actually try and go aggressive, but look at this. Diamond's <laughs> going to come and join him. They have a tower to tank through. He's going to keep on following. He's tanking up the turret. He's tanking up Soas. The, oh, shockwave the shockwave misses. Diamond comes around, but again, they don't have enough to finish him off. Has to drag him to send away. Yellow Star comes in, throws Timbers down. Darian goes down. It's Peke that picks up the kill. Now they're going to go to Diamond. The rest of Gambit have given up on this one. They know that Diamond is dead. It's a matter of who gets the kill. It's going to be so Edward just gets pulled in by the shockwave, dropped right down. A diamond, how tanky is he? It doesn't matter, he's just getting dropped straight down. That's the inhibitor turret going down there. Cyanide gonna run away from this one. Darian desperate for the kill, but he just can't get it. And now Reckless comes back around the side. He's hitting everything. Peke gets the
the kills. It's another double for him. He's 816, the inhibitor. This is going to be game fanatic. Sinai didn't even die. He got out. He dove into four members of Gambit, and the super tanks are tanky. It took them a while to die, but they didn't have enough damage. LeBlanc, Alexic has been unable to find priority targets, and Fnatic in 30 minutes are going to pick up the first victory of the LCS. Absolutely fantastic stuff. Fnatic just tanking down slowly. Will they get forced away? It seems they will. Soas gets up. Can he go down? He's at 3 0 10. The last thing he wants to do is die and lose one of those stats to Diamond. And again, they back away. It's Old Gambit get the better. Super minions are in. They pick the fight. Shockwave on Edward once again. He gets dropped before he even uses that ultimate. He gets taken straight down. Darian comes in. Diamond comes in. The tanks run in the front line, but they just don't have enough damage to follow through. That's going to be another double kill for Peke. Darian's going to get focused on one more hit. Should take him down. It's not going to be from Reckless this time around. <laughs> it will be. Finally, takes him down. He's 809. Peke 1017. And Yellow Star, the unkillable. 0 0 15, the perfect support right now, and Gamut are just licking their wounds. Engage after engage has been perfect from Yellow Star. He didn't even need Tibbers in that previous engagement. They only burned the shockwave. All five members of Fnatic on the necklace. Nexus, and it's finally over. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Game one of the European 2014 season of the LCS, and what an impressive debut for Reckless right there. Ending the game 8 0 9.